imagine a world where capitalism somehow allows us to fix climate change, to somehow heal inequality? Can, can you envision a world where that happens? Well, one is that you can never downplay the creativity of human beings. There's no doubt that the virtues of markets have to do with scientific breakthroughs and technological innovations. It's a beautiful thing. What you have to do is to make sure the markets are subordinate to public welfare. Mm. But unfortunately, especially in the United States, it's very difficult to be optimistic about American capitalism. It's had a long time to generate these results. That have to, I mean, I'm, in my campaign, I'm calling for an abolition of poverty, abolition of homelessness, strong defense of workers, strong defense of women, control over bodies and so forth, and a real accountability of the organized greed at the top. We, we talk on a regular basis about how, how many job openings are still out there, how you know bosses can't find people to fill these positions. Why is the data indicating that minorities are impacted the most by this? Well, communities of color are going to face greater threats of evictions because they tend to have less intergenerational wealth to hold them through uh, periods of financial instability. Um, you know, because rents are so high, um, for a lot of families, those margins are just really small. So a single event like the death of a family member, a major medical crisis, or the loss of income, um, that's just enough to, to put you at the risk of eviction. 